there's this evolution that goes on with the way we utilize tech. It's happening already, uh, and it's gonna keep on creeping in. Uh, we are traveling to space wherever it is. All these things that are great, that are necessary for us to survive in prosperity on a planet that unfortunately isn't getting any larger. Even maybe get the first glimpses of life on other planets, and that could even happen in my lifetime. I think that we've done so many things in you know this this time span of humanity that we might have thought was impossible, and it's just not. Well, I would say we're inevitably going to start understanding other planets, uh, but it is there's some big challenges to try to get there and study them in detail. At an extreme, you can think about well, when we travel to other planets, and we can start with the closest one we're thinking about, which is Mars. And even in that environment, you cannot go there right now and even survive like we do on a space station. But our bodies are going to be, they're going to be like subjected to things we never experience here on Earth. I actually think getting off to other worlds, that is going to be extremely challenging. You know, if we want to go outside uh, of our space station and work and build something, uh, to repair something, you can't just go out there as like the fleshy one. I mean, you have to put your own, basically your own spaceship on. You're in it and it's a, t it's a tool. I mean, that, that's the, I think, the simplest way to think about your spacesuit is that it's a tool for you to be able to survive outside in the vacuum of space. But you are totally respectful of this environment you're in. And you totally understand that the reason you're there is because of this, you know, this suit that's on you. I have a friend who is dealing with Parkinson's. And every time I see him, I think, oh my gosh, why aren't we using one of those, you know, those suits, like those body suits that you can wear that can create the motion that you would normally have. Because he can still walk, he can still move. There are forces that are going to come together in ways that I can only guess is going to cause many, many people to want to have that technology as part of them. Um, those same sensors that they're using in this robot to work in some kind of space environment are the ones that they need to incorporate into those kinds of systems. Um, I think those are, those are interesting things to consider.